rise and shine guys today we are traveling to my beautiful hometown of Byron Bay now we have been up since four o'clock which is actually three because daylight savings started in New South Wales so we have been up for a very long time and we are so excited to just get there and get past all this crazy traveling business So we finally arrived at Ballina Airport and the kids were so stoked to get off the plane. We headed straight out to the baggage terminal and went for my mum who was there and then we just strapped the kitties in and off we went to our family home. Traveling for so long, the kids were getting really restless, and so mum was trying to preoccupy them with the cows. But because we have those back in Richmond, they were not having it. <laughs> We had finally arrived and we could get out of the car and just relax. Izzy was so happy he even fell over. <laughs> is a John Deere tractor. Oh, we're gonna have a ride of the tractor today? Yes. Ah, oh, look at this, it's a beautiful seat. Hop in there, Izzy. Even Nora the, Beans the wants to get in. in here. They're all in there. Look at those two, look at them. So here we are, finally on holiday at my parents' house, which is in the Northern Rivers of Australia and it's very peaceful here compared to our home in the Hawkesbury. Nora's riding on the quad. Woo! Go Nora! Hey! Nora, Nora, Nora the Explorer. Day one of being in Byron and this is what my sister has made. What is this, Tyler? Salad. <laughs> <laughs> but what's in it? It looks so delish. Like, tell me what's in it. Everything. Tell Cucumber. my 12 subscribers. <laughs> Tomatoes, olives, feta, beetroot, pumpkin. Mm. Pretty much everything. Avocado. Okay. And tell everybody what's in this. It's mm. mm, a salsa. It's a salsa. It's like just so delicious. But it's a secret recipe that nobody knows how to make except for <laughs> After lunch, it was time to put the boys to work. So we sent them out with the bobcat to do some clearing and to make sure the tree was gonna be really safe to make the swing harness. My dad had this idea that we could create an awesome harness or zip line or something that the kids could play in while they were here. And it turned out pretty good. And that is where we are gonna put the swing, guys. 
How cool is that? Here's my dad using the spider crane, I think that's what it's called, to go up into the tree and tie the rope around. So the boys had a lot of fun using the mechanical side of this and having a go in the crane. I helped my puppy build the harness on with the spider crane. It was so fun in the crane. swing on the swing and I got really really higher than before. Dolly was a scaredy cat so he didn't want to go high so it was too um, it was too hilarious to watch him. We headed down to the beach in the afternoon just because we knew it was going to be high tide and this is one of our favourite local spots. It's in Brunswick Heads and it's just a really nice safe spot for the kids to play and I don't know, just kind of get out and have a bit of fun. After the beach we were off to the Byron Bay main pub for dinner because we just wanted to celebrate finally being in Byron Bay and just enjoying the afternoon. It was going to be an early dinner just because the day has just been so long getting to Byron and hopefully after this I'm going to put the kids to bed and relax myself but so far we've made it here and we are so stoked. Thank you for watching guys, hope you can keep up with our journey and we love meeting you all on TikTok and Instagram. Sending you love again, peace out the Vada Druckers.